Good morning. It's Monday. You catching me before I go into work? Because y'all know as soon as I get out of this car, I'm busy all day long. So this is the only like five minutes of free time I have is right before I get out of the car. So here we go. It's time for some childhood memories. I hope it brings back some kind of nostalgia or, you know, maybe trauma. I don't know, but, you know, come on, collectively. <laughs> You know, I was thinking this morning, I was getting ready for work, and I was like, oh, what time is it? You know, I got, got the little watch or whatever, and then it, it it's triggered a memory. Do y'all remember those rings that were watches? Do y'all remember that? I had one, and I could never wear it because it always pinched my finger. You know what I mean? But did y'all have that? It was a big old watch on top of a ring. I don't, I don't know why it sparked that memory, but it did. And now, I didn't ever have this because my mama, bless her heart, couldn't sew, you know? But did y'all ever have those jumpsuits that were made by somebody or by your memo or your aunt or your mama got the pattern from the Walmart and made it? I don't know. But there was those one-piece jumpsuits, and they had that big square, like, lace collar on them. You look like you were, like, Amish or something. And that's not derogatory to the Amish. That's just what it reminds me of is, is that particular um, type of attire. I didn't ever have one of those, thank goodness. Um, but I did, as a child, have some of those, like, one-piece jumpsuits. You know what I mean? That were terrible. And they usually had, like, the little la elastic um, on the ankles. Or they had, like, lace around the bottom. I hated them things. Because I, I, I don't like pink. I don't like a lot of girly stuff. You know, lace and things like that. So even as a child, it just gave me the ick. I hated wearing those things. And do y'all remember the banana hair clips? Now, I've always had long hair my entire life. This is the first short hair I've ever had. It's always been like all the way down to my butt ever since I was a little girl. But I had really fine hair. So I could never get those damn banana clips to work. I'd put them in and then they would just slide out of my hair. You know what I mean? It didn't, it didn't have enough oomph to hold it in there. But did y'all use those banana clips? I wanted to use them. I just, I, I couldn't make it work. <laughs> and I know, ladies, we love the leggings, right? I am a leggings advocate, okay? Um, but do you remember stirrup pants? Do y'all remember those stirrup pants? I don't even know if they're still around anymore. If they are, I've missed them. They're not, um, uh, you know, in my repertoire of clothing or wardrobe. But they were like, okay, for the ones that don't know, they were leggings, basically, but they had stirrups on the bottom. So you could put them up under your feet, which kept them from riding up your legs. It was so weird. And they always felt uncomfortable you put your shoes on. And I'm real weird about my feet and shoes anyway, but that stuff would just be rubbing on the bottom of your foot, and I couldn't stand it. it was, I was, like, way overstimulated with that thing touching the bottom of my foot. How many of y'all wore stirrup pants? I'll wait. Speaking of the clothes we wore, wore, wear, well, I, listen to my brain, it's Monday. Y'all remember the stonewashed jeans? They're they trying to come back now, but it wasn't the, you know, y'all remember the original stonewashed jeans and some of them suckers had the pleated, they were pleated in the front. You know what I'm talking about? Honey. Yeah, we were styling. Styling. You couldn't tell us nothing. We, we wouldn't listen anyway. And along with that, the wind, the wind did not stand a chance. Not a chance. Because we had wind suits. Wind suits. Top, bottom, matching matching and if you really wanted to flex on them you had the matching socks several different colors of socks would you put on three different pair of socks so that you had all the colors that matched your windsuit because same and we would just scrunch them down you know the socks so that and you'd alternate colors on the opposite foot just, just call us ranch honey because we was dressing and and wasn't no way you could like sneak up on nobody in that thing because whoosh, 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 that's the sound it would make when you walked <laughs> Sound like the wind itself. Look like look like you was about to parachute out of a plane or something with that thing on, honey. But we was we was doing it. I don't know what it was, but we thought we had it. Loud ass pants. And last but certainly not least, did you have or want to have, but it wasn't in your mama's budget or whatever, the entire room set? I'm talking about whatever character or whatever that you was into at the time, strawberry shortcake or you know, the G.I. Joe transform, whatever it was, the entire bedroom set, I'm talking about the pillowcases, the pillow shams, the entire 
you know, bedspread comforter of it. And if you got the whole nine yards, you had the curtains that matched and you had that, that little cloth that would go over the side table beside your bed that was like a skirt for the table that matched also. You had everything that was in that character. It just all simultaneously went together. Speaking of which, did any of your girls have the canopy bed that had the top on it? I thought that was like the epitome of rich or something if you had a bed that had that little canopy piece on top of it. Or if I came into your house and you messed around and had some bunk beds, I was like, these folks are rich. Y'all real, real rich over here. I'm, I'm talking about name brand sodas in the refrigerator, Rich. Wasn't, wasn't no RC Cola or Big K Colas or none of that kind of, you know, brand up in there. And I know Big K came later, but you know what I'm talking about. Name brand peanut butter. Y'all got Jif over here? What? Y'all got, got individual slices of cheese individually wrapped? Where am I? Y'all ain't got that one big block of government cheese that everybody has to shave some off and share? Fancy. <laughs> Have a good day.